tight end. I always say the tight end is always more of a threat in the red zone. He's a big target, and his skills sometimes cause matchup problems for the defense. He's good. They capitalize on great field position, John. Yep. Took it right at him with excellent execution of the right call. Number one will be kicking off. Short kick. He didn't get much of that one. From the 22-yard line. Dantzler is able to get it to the 20. The Thunder come out with eight guys in the box. On the move. He hits his receiver. Brooks is there for this tackle. That's a 35-yard line. That was a good adjustment by the receiver as he reads the main coverage and finds open space. The thing with these option routes is everyone has to make their read quickly and make their adjustments quickly. Running option routes and running them effectively takes a lot of repetition and practice. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. Almost at the two-minute mark now. 42-yard line. Berlin comes out in their nickel package. Setting up play action. Deep throw. Looking for something downfield. Nothing was there, though, and it's third down now. Two-minute warning coming up. Ball on the 42-yard line. The Thunder come out of a nickel pack. The blitz is on. Number 36 comes up to make the play at the 47-yard line. Ball on the 47-yard line. Number nine out of the gun. They're blitzing. Let's rid of it. Right on target to the wide receiver. So they get two first downs on their last two plays. And they're getting it done by seeing the whole field and taking what the defense gives them. First and ten. Ball on the 32 yard line. The Thunder come out in a dime package. Throws it. He finds his man. He took what he was given, completing the pass. Yeah, what you want to do as a receiver who's facing zone coverage is to break into the secondary, find a hole, settle down, and show the quarterback your number. That was a good job. The Thunder come out in a dime packet. Gets the pass off. Broken up. Here's what happened. The quarterback just didn't have a throwing lane for his pass. And we let that one go. The lineman got his hand up, and he batted it down at the line. the pass he was tipped he has a great feel for defending the pass and he always seems to be in great position to make a play in the ball so instead of attempting the field goal they're going to go for it still is there for the tackle just simply power football there converting on fourth down let me tell you the defense knew it was coming they dug in, and they did their best not to get knocked off the line. But the offensive line just really wanted that one. So they're inside the 20, need to get a touchdown. Throws to the end zone. In and out of his hands. Number 86. Had a touchdown that time. Could have held on. You're right. He was there. Got good position. And he saw it fall to the ground. 11th play of this drive. Line up with six defensive backs. Looking to run it here. 
They'll go with a play fake. Gets rid of it. Number 57 comes up to make the play. At the six. This is a textbook type drop. And the thing is, everything they called has worked. Even when it hasn't worked, it still worked. Six more yards and they'll put up six. Berlin with six defensive backs. Hand off to the tailback. And he's in for the score. And he powers his way in there. He follows that push and he gets the score. Number 10 comes in for the point after, which will knot it up. The point after is good. Galloway was the key man on that drive, getting a lot of big yardage. He's a very tough runner to bring down. And when he gets those legs pumping and gets that kind of blocking, it signals a long drive for the defense. Nice kick and returnable. From the 10-yard line. Defense looks to rebound after that last effort when they allow the touchdown. Ball on their own 23. Ragone using split backs. Throwing. Jumps and makes the catch. He's a tough guy, and he'll go for those passes wherever they are. Second and about one. Here they come. Throws this one off balance. Number 85 was the one they were trying to get the ball to. This is where the defense needs to just play smart and not give up a big play. There's not a whole lot of time left, so they just need to prevent them from getting into field goal range. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. The offense has been stepping up on third down all day. Gets rid of it, and it's caught. Harriman comes up to make the play at the 39-yard line. Several defensive backs. Interception. Keeps his feet moving. What an interception. Great position by Grant. And here's the thing. He's back there in his zone. And he's looking right at the quarterback's eye. And when the quarterback let it go, he was all over. First and this should be the last play of the half. 35 yard line. The Thunder come out in a dime package. Throws it. Picked off. They'll go to the locker room with the score even. Number one comes in to kick off. From the 16-yard line. Rightful. He's able to get it to the 28-yard line. Ball on their own 28. The Thunder come out in a dime package. Hang the ball to the back. Hilton records the tackle at the 33. Galloway. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. 
You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. Dimeback in for this play. Blitz is coming. Off his back foot. Whitaker was his intended target. Whitaker, the intended receiver on the play. Third and five. Ball on the 33 yard line. I'll come through, baby. Berlin looks like they're playing the pass as they're lined up in the dime. And it's intercepted. And the rain is having the expected effect in this one, John. Those new footballs they use are pretty slick out there to start with. Then you take a snap or two of them, it gets wet, and it slips out of the hand a little more when you throw. Then boom, a defender is right there to pick it off. So they're ready to go on offense after the interception. They'll start at the 33-yard line. The Galaxy come out with one linebacker and several defensive backs. The running game's not been a factor all day. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. Second and 12. Ball on the 35-yard line. Hold the look! The Galaxy come out in the quarter defense. Throws it. He was tipped. Booms was the intended receiver on that play. The defense has had difficulty stopping them on third down. Protected well. Goes again. Number 92. Comes up to make the play. They're sort of in field goal range, but it would have to be a long one. Sets up, waiting for the punt. No return here. Back it comes to the 20. Is there on the stop at the 29 yard line? A solid running game starts with a blocking of the offensive line. But the ball carrier must have good vision so he can take advantage of the holes that they open up. Second and one coming up. The two extra defensive backs, the defense is in the dime. Can't bring them down. Mays comes up to make the play at the 36. it away. Nice play fake. With a deep throw to the right side. Receiver running and breaks free. The 10. Touchdown, Galaxy. When you get this kind of execution, you got a great chance of making a big play. Watch it here as everyone takes care of their assignment. The pass is thrown where the receiver can make the best play in the ball. And it's six points. The point answer is good. After the touchdown, the score is 14-7. Galaxy. Number seven is back and ready to put this one in the air. From the 11. Of course, the three and out on the offense's last possession. It's first and ten. Out of the eye formation. Hand it off. 
is there for the tackle at the 38-yard line. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running play has been today. Ball on their own 38. Frankfurt comes out in the quarter defense. Rifle is the guy who's there to bring him down at the 42. They were looking past, and instead they got the run. In some of these situations, it's hard to figure out the best defense to call. But generally, you want to call dime or quarter when the other team has three or four wide receivers in the game. Tackle at the 44-yard line. That's a half dozen tackles now. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. 